Well, I originally planned to report that head coach of the Nets, Steve Nash, said that Kyrie was going to play some games and miss some games to the media. I thought Kyrie was going to have his own practice facility. I figured they'd go ahead and get him separate travel arrangements, hotels, essentially do whatever they had to do to hold on to him. He's one of the league's most impressive talents, for God's sake. I mean, just yesterday, they released a statement saying that Kyrie would be able to practice with the team. But apparently, the organization has had enough of the media circuit because Brooklyn Nets GM Sean Marks released the following statement. Kyrie Irving will not play or practice with the team until he is eligible to be a full participant. Kyrie has made a personal choice, and we respect his individual right to choose. Currently, the choice restricts his ability to be a full-time member of the team, and we will not permit any member of our teams to participate with part-time availability. A definitive statement. While a person's medical status is protected by HIPAA laws in America, so Kyrie is not required to divulge his vaccination status to the public, the Nets are also legally obligated to keep Kyrie's medical records private. Still, Marx expounded on the issue when asked if Kyrie was vaccinated, stating, if he was vaccinated, we wouldn't be having this discussion. I think that's probably pretty clear. Might as well just answer the question, Mark. Marx also said he and the owner, Joe Tsai, together made the decision, adding that it came through discussions with Irving and his associates. Reiterating that again, this is a choice that Kyrie had, and he was well aware of that. So the organization has taken a hard position. No more talks of accommodations, no part-time players. It's all or none. Get the shot or go shoot at LA Fitness because you're not getting in the Barclays without it. Was this a good decision or a bad decision by the Nets? What'd you think? And what would you do if you were Kyrie? Let me know in the comments and make sure you subscribe because we are most definitely keeping our eyes on this and we'll update you as soon as any news breaks on the situation.